Welcome back to Metroid Prime, the GameCube edition with a lot of good stuff working in there for some decent graphics, hopefully. If you guys could leave a like, comment, or subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Anything you could do for the channel helps me put more back into the channel for you. That being said, let's do this. Oh, that was effective. Let's see, where do we need to go? We need to go blue. One bomberu is more than enough. Okay, you know what? Hard mode is actually beginning to eat into my health, so I'm uh, I'm gonna take some resources where I get them now. The space pirates love to spam the crap out of their beams. Not like I can talk much. The difference is my beam is missiles, and their beam is pew 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 pew. pew, pew. Yeah, my beam is better, stronger. Faster. More powerful. What do we got to do? It is on the wrong side, so we need to do two more. There we go. Yep. Gotta start getting shot at, aren't I? Don't get to do anything with it yet. Do I care to shoot you? Kinda do, because I kinda need to take my time in the next room. That wasn't enough plasma, so this next battle's gonna be a little lost. Uh, Dependent on my aim. Oh, nope. this is not the room that I thought it was. But I'll take the free resources. Give me better resources than that, I hope. Eh, that's a little bit better. I think what? The purples are 10 and the not purples are 50? That was very worth the damage I just took. Okay, I think it's clear I have no idea where I'm at in all this. There's the impact crater. I always try to look for it, but uh, I think we're either directly below the tower that enters the artifact temple, or directly across from it. Not entirely sure. I'm not minding the missiles. Especially for what's coming. Speaking of not minding, Oof. yeah, that's actually for you guys. Speaking of not minding the missiles, I don't know why they had to make this such a hard one. Oh, right, forget about this guy. Um, let's see what's gonna be best for him. Got any interesting lore? Military great crap. Security command. Test subject ZD, hereafter referred to as Metroid Prime, ooh, was recently discovered in a cavern by mining crews. It quickly dispatched to miners, but was eventually contained by security units and drones. Once contained, we were able to begin studies upon Metroid Prime. The results have been astonishing. It is genetically similar to Metroid's, albeit on a highly evolved level. It displays a limitless capacity for phase-on infusion and shows no phase-on-based degeneration whatsoever. It continues to grow in size, and while it has manifested some psychotic behavior, it's a Metroid, what do you expect? The cold fields have we use to pacify remain effective. Authorization for advanced studies on Metroid Prime have been approved. Damn, bro. My condolences to your research team, because you're going to die. Much like this dude. Come on, missile beam.
Yeah, and the driver actually paid attention from my last playthrough that after you scan and read the dude's actual lore, uh, I think we got pirates we're gonna have to worry about here in a second. But, um, you can... <laughs> I get that guy? Uh, you can target his thing with thermal visor and then just pretty much blow up the thing with missiles. Ah, silence. Hey, I think we're on Metroid Prime. Uh, those aren't red. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's a red one. Uh, Spectre Rolls. Yeah. They're called Chozo Ghosts. Don't bother with them, you'll be fine, probably. Subject, Metroid Prime's breach has been contained. Reports indicate that it sensed a large batch of raw phase on in the lab from within its stasis tank and broke through the glass using previously unsuspected strength. Besides consuming all of the phase on, Metroid Prime assimilated several weapons and defense systems from fallen security units. It has suffered no ill effects from said assimilation. Indeed, it begun to use its newly acquired weapons against us. Once we pacified it, we were unable to remove the assimilated gear without threat to Metroid Prime. The gear is now an integral part of its body. Command is intrigued by this newfound ability and has ordered further study to commence at once. I mean, yeah, if I could slap a rocket launcher to my back and give it infinite ammo, I'd be pretty interested in continuing that ability. Those are artifacts, nobody cares about those. Uh, nothing's useful there. One of these is gonna open the door. Metroid Prime continues to feed and grow even larger in the Impact Crater Caves. Its hunger knows no bounds and it has begun to manifest unusual mutations since its breach. These include armor plating on its epidermis and mechanical outgrowth that generate defensive screens or defense screens these screens render invulnerable to most weapon systems but a flaw in the mutation leads to increased vulnerability to certain weapons it compensates for this by shifting the screens quickly this latest development concerns security units greatly i feel it's a matter of time before metro prime corrects this defect and renders itself invulnerable to all weaponry Containment would be uh, nigh impossible if it sort of occurred. And there's Force Relaxes. Yeah. Hey, this cool, unstoppable being of immense strength and power that we love so much is becoming more unstoppable. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Quit letting it break out. Kill it while you have the chance. Those are the top two options that come to my head. One of the best way to analyze something? On a chopping block. Nothing's good there. What do we got? I think it is. I don't remember what this pirate is. Uh, of course, it's a wave pirate. Why not? Ow. Bro's got good aim. I can use your tricks against you too, bro. Oh, that's not good. I like how this dude's fighting for his life. And the other guy is like, dee 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 dee. Speaking of, dee 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 dee. Oh no, now they can hit me. Gotta suck, bro. 
We're gonna go ahead and deactivate this. I don't think that there's... Oh, there might be some more relevant lore. Interesting read, anyway. Believe we'll pirates, uh, I don't really care about them. We're about to get a brisk running with one here in a second, though. Very brisk and very here in a second. Do we have enough missiles? Let's find out. Excuse you. He's supposed to try to kill me right now. Ow. Oh. Can we see it? Shit. Doesn't see me. There's a plus. It's over there. In case you don't know what I'm looking for, it's a really active security drone. Oh shit. That's not a hiding space. This is just like the other security drones. What? Ah. Eat a dick. <laughs> yeah, now you can see it. If you had x-ray visor at this point, you'd be able to. We'll definitely showcase that when I come through here with way more upgrades than I should have. But, uh, yeah. That thing's just a dick. Eh, we don't need health or nothing. Not on a time limit when we're in here either. Despite the fact that the music definitely kind of seems to make it feel like that. That doesn't really get me anywhere. Apparently it does. Oh, it opens up this. I'm an idiot. Now, you know what? This doesn't hurt that much. Screw it. Okay. It kind of does hurt. Maybe we should not screw it that hard. Thank you. Yeah. Power bombs acquired. Blow the living shit out of things you don't like by pressing these buttons. And briefly after this, we're going to go and get, uh, what is it? Grapple beam. I died to that thing so many times growing up. It wasn't until I started playing this game much later that I realized you could get so many things earlier on just by breaking the game, more or less doing things out of sequence. I'll take a free heal, please. And we might as well go for a save. I think we earned it. We don't get those guys yet, do we? No, we do not. Later on, pirates start spawning up there every time we come through here. Which isn't that bad, because they don't come through here very often. Ow. Panic, get this. Is. Yep. Poor guys just got rendered a joke. Oh yeah, I remember where this is. We don't need to be here. You know that we can do here. That being said, it doesn't hurt to kill a bunch of space pirates ever, so we're just gonna go ahead and do that. Just gonna activate that and then walk right back out the door. <laughs> I'm sure they won't mind. Damn it.
Did I miss something? I mean, yeah, you're not supposed to be able to get this. So you gotta come back. So we literally gotta go back the entire way. I don't feel like shooting these guys. I'm not sure I'm gonna get much of a choice in the matter, but I don't feel like it. Forgot that uh, ice pirates are the easiest. Sounds like a badass name, but no, ice pirates are kind of a pushover. Any lore down there? There's no lore down there. Fuck! Uh, thank you very much. Please stay there. I definitely don't have the missiles to deal with you bastards. Speaking of not having the missiles to deal with bastards. So, uh, you see how there's no guy in that tank, and there was a guy, and how there's no enemies around, and how there was enemies around? Fuck it. That's a whammy if I've ever seen one. Oh, that was fun. Things aren't giving me nothing. Jesus. Give me some missiles, man. I'll take a free map. It's the map, it's the map, it's the map. Hmm, data. Because everybody carries around their Google Maps inside of their gun. Well, on the plus side, we get another energy tank, I think. Or is it missiles? It's probably missiles, isn't it? Yeah, I like an energy tank, but it's probably going to be missiles. No, it is an energy tank. Nice. Back in my hole. So let's count them up now. Let's see, what is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 energy tanks. Oh boy. I remember this area, okay. One missile, two pirates. More pirates for me. 
Come on, give me the pirates. Give me. There you are. You guys didn't even give me anything. Where does this go? This takes me almost outside. Do I want to go almost outside? I don't want to go almost outside. I want to go back and I want to get me a grapple beam. But then, technically, we go through, yeah, then we should be able to go and get ourselves a plasma beam. And that's going to be badass. Now that we're probably going to get the bag more and save, but eventually we'll get plasma beam. Can't go wrong with missiles. Considering it's the only thing I don't have right now. I wish I could see this when it was sunny out. It'd be so much more detail. But it's never sunny. I need to look up to figure out what you're actually supposed to do to make it sunny. Now. Is it? I gotta go over here and uh Oh we get Metroids now, wonderful. Pretty odds it just killed that Metroid. Oof. We're supposed to go. It's good enough. It's a good thing Metroids are a pushover in this game. I mean, they're a pushover in every game as long as you get an ice beam. It's kind of one of the bigger reasons why it's a shame they didn't take more advantage of the Metroids in uh, Metroid Fusion. That uh, would have been quite the hindrance because you don't get ice beam till literally the game is over. Now those metroids kind of aren't much of a threat in this game, which is a bit weird. We got a cage over here to keep them out. He's gone, Riff Raff. Ah, you dick. That's it. I'm exterminating you guys again. Speak now or get frozen and blown up. I had no problem with leaving you guys alone, but you couldn't leave me alone. Morpo looks badass on this track, by the way. Something with the colors sapping away. Oh yeah. Got her seals a gripple beam. Was on the other side of this thing. Oh, wait, this is how you get back to the other spot. Um, what? There we go. And here we go. I don't think there's anything else I need to do here, so we're just gonna run for it. Bye bye, pirates. Wonder what they were gonna put over here. I wouldn't put a hole in the wall for nothing. 
Maybe that was gonna be like the section where uh, Metroid Prime broke down the whole area or something. Otherwise, why would they cut the slats out of the elevator? Like they have on, uh, what is it, the one in Magmore? At this point, we can go get X-ray visor. Even though that would have been really handy to have earlier. And then after that, we can go and we can get uh, plasma beam. Oh, that worked out well. Through the gate, and there's a big plant. Up, up, and away. There we go. We're gonna go blow up some, uh, dead people. All right. Forgot about the groove. There we go. Made it. More missiles. Probably like three or four uh, energy tanks away from being done. Man, there we go. Get me through the hole. Just go through the hole, damn it. There we go. Should not have been that difficult. The last visor. And now we're gonna do a little bit of boom second like a uh... Yep, what is this number seven? Number six, that's right. Well, we can rather easily get some of them now. There we go. That dude is being weird. Oh, oh we got the x ray scope, which is going to be wonderful because we're about to get assaulted by dead people, and that's going to be not so wonderful. Another way, if you ever want to skip one of these puzzles, half the time you could just space jump into it. Let's say this jump's possible, probably with a convenient scan dash, but there's uh, nothing to scan dash off of. I love the pirates. Or not pirates. The Chuzu. The ghosts of Chuzu past. Oddly enough, it is very difficult to see with this visor. I don't even know where they are. Okay. 
I've just got the last one to worry about. Where's he at? Come at me, bro. Suck at my chosen artifacts. Eat lead, boy. Boom shakalaka. Probably could use a few more super missiles, but uh, that seemed like overkill. And here we go. Missiles. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba 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 That point is cancer causing. Where's this go? Chozo South. We want to go to Chozo. We don't really need plasma beam for Chozo. We're going to go to Chozo. Go to Chozo. Find a save station. Call it quits for this recording session. Oh, wow. oh man, I guess it'd be pretty convenient if I'd come here with, uh, oh, what is it? A plasma beam, but oh well. I think we can kind of start walking by all of the Chozo ghosts now. Oh no. Whatever will I do? Don't worry, we get to do it again. Watch this. Oh no. Whatever will I do? Good thing those guys can't figure out that they can just walk over here. Well, now we have gravity. We could go get that one missile that we abandoned in the uh, charge beam area. Do we care to do that? Wouldn't hurt, and we're going through missiles quite quickly. Yeah, I guess we'll do that. We'll do a little bit of cleanup around here. I mean, hell, what are we missing? I don't think we're missing anything anymore. We don't need uh, plasma here. Nothing plasma -able. We'll go clean up, grab some missiles. Uh, give me those, thank you. I'll take those. Oh, I don't have anybody I could shoot. Damn. There we go. Care about the rest. Missiles. You know, you would think there'd be some lore or something down here, but nope. What do I have? I think I have more than 120 missiles total. Kind of bad because there's 225 or 255 in the game. Maybe it's 250 in this one. 
think it varies depending on which game you're playing. Ah, uh, what do I want to do here? We will go across. Not really any benefit in fighting these guys, so we'll just ignore them. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this missile. Bye, bounce American fly. Ah, about fell off. Inside it. About to get a lot of missiles. Your butts keep trying to fall out. I already got more than enough missiles, but there's no such thing. Gotta cheat her way through here now. Ooh. Yeah, our air conditioning is not that good. Here's the thing at over here. Let's see it. Yeah, I can kind of just uh, do this though, can I? There we go. That took a minute longer than it should have. Oh yeah, I forgot there's lore here. What is this one going about? It's kind of late game, isn't it? The power of our temple has been enough to halt the spread of the poison on Talon 4, but that which remains thrives and grows more concentrated, gnawing on itself in the dark passages beneath the planet's surface. Whether it can ever be truly destroyed is not for our eyes to see, but there is something else. We chose our drifting, tumbling through space and time as the great poison eats away at our sanity. We wake in dreams as the veil of lunacy descends. As past and future blend and shuffle, one image appears and flickers through the landscape. Wraith-like, it is the hatchling, the newborn, walking in the path of, the corrupt, of corruption, a lone figure shining in the toxic shadows. She comes dressed for war and her wrath is terrible. Do our eyes look backwards seeing the hatchling as she once was? Or does she approach even now, arriving in our race's last hour, a savior clothed in machines crafted long ago by Chozo hands? Poisonous clouds drift across our vision. Bro, you gave me the suit. Don't bitch about how I use it. Oh, forgot about this one. Yeah, it took me a long time to realize there was something here the first time I tried to 100% uh, this. Ah, oh, I just don't get a break, do I? Oh, another energy tank. Okay, I'll stop bitching now. Spot. These walls are like glue. Here we go.
Phoebe. These dudes really do like bird-shaped stuff. I, mean, I know we have our own statues, but we don't just have literally people's heads everywhere. We call them bus, and they're very nice. careful about coming out of this one. I've fallen off way too many times. Here we go. God damn it. Get wrecked, bitch. Did you just walk through a fucking power bomb? Piss off. Oh, how am I supposed to jump up here? There we go. For some reason I get the feeling this is not gonna be enough. How it is, and I'll take it. Put away two energy tanks away. Uh, I think I've collected. Oh no, we still got to go through that section and also get that uh, artifact that's over here while we have uh, gravity suit. Still no missiles from those bricks. Yeah, you bricks. Uh, now we got to deal with screamers. Missed it. There we go. More missiles. guys could be a little bit quieter. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go to Magmore and save. And I feel like that was 20 minutes ago. Another artifact acquired. We're not gonna get Wave Buster. Nobody likes Wave Buster. Wave Buster is dumb. Wait, is this supposed to be the fountain on top of the world? Because this is the life giver artifact? I feel like that would make more sense than the stupid flower. Just a little bit anyway. I guess it could be considered a fountain. Alright, so... I think we got everything? Definitely way more than we had before, that's for sure. Might be like one or two, probably like one missile thing hiding somewhere around here that I didn't even remember. But we'll live without it. Uh, we're gonna go back to the overworld. We're gonna save and call it there, and then when we come back, we will. Hey, you know what? Just screw you guys. Well, yeah, we're gonna go to Magmort and we're gonna get ourselves a plasma beam. Hell yeah. Wee. Gotta love these elevators. Uh. 
doesn't even nothing even phases me anymore. Not even lost an energy tank just by walking through enemies. Who needs the most powerful beam I've got? I've got power beam. Suck it, bro. Ooh, that's a, an energy tank in a quarter. What are we gonna do? We're gonna kick butt, that's what we're gonna do. Alrighty. Thanks you guys for coming along for the ride today. If you could leave a like, comment, or subscribe, I would appreciate it. Let me know how you're enjoying the content so far. Anything you do for the channel helps me put more back into the channel for you. That being said, I will see you next time. Have a good one.